everyone. I've got this really cute hair tutorial to share with you. But first of all, I do want to let everyone know that I am not a hair professional whatsoever. This is just kind of how I've learned how to cut hair. So I do want to apologize in advance that if I'm not explaining things correctly or using the correct verbiage to explain things in this video, please forgive me. So with that said, if you would like to see how I was able to achieve this really cute A-line bob haircut for my beautiful niece, Erin, then please keep watching. Okay, so the first thing that I'm doing here is just putting some holes into this trash bag to act as a cover for her. Because you know the feeling when hair gets stuck on her skin, it just irritates and it is just not a good feeling overall, right? We wanted to avoid that by using a trash bag to cover her up. And just so you guys know, all the tools that I used in this video, minus the trash bag, were all from the dollar store. That's because, like I have said in the intro, I am not a hair professional whatsoever, so I do not own any professional hair tools or accessories or anything like that. I utilize whatever that I have on hand. And I just so remember that all of the tools I used here were from the dollar store. So that goes to tell you that dollar items do get the job done. Anyway, um, once that I have the bag over her, I went ahead and just wet her hair with water so I could comb through it, making sure there's no tangle and no knots. And here I'm just getting ready to put up her hair, leaving a small section down. And this is going to be the first cut that we will make to act as our guide line. And also it is going to be the longest part in the back. So I do want to let you know that if you want to attempt this haircut after watching this video of anything, that if you don't want the back to be as short as hers, then make sure that you cut it slightly longer. And here I think I went ahead and cut it to about the level of her chin and to the width of her neck. Once I have that cut into a perfectly straight line, I went ahead and moved forward to concentrate on the side. And here I'm cutting it into a diagonal direction, making sure that the front hangs longer than the back because an A-line bob haircut is slightly longer in the front. Once I have this side done, I went ahead and just repeated the same step onto the other side. And what I'm doing here is just basically repeating the first step where I created another small layer and cutting it right at the guide line. And here we're just taking smaller parts and cutting at about a 45 degree angle just so that the layers blend and that they stack nicely together. So basically I'm just going to go ahead and repeat the same steps throughout the back. This is how the hair is coming along. You can actually see all of the beautiful layers. They blend so well together, right? It creates such a beautiful stack. Now to finish this off, we are just going to pull the hair from the side straight out, point cut into the hair to give it some layers, just so that the hair on the sides are not so flat and boring. And once we have the other side finished, that is basically it to this haircut. So thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you taking your time to watch this video. If you do have any questions for me, feel free to leave it in the comments down below. And until the next one, always remember to love you for who you are. I hope to see you soon. Bye.